three-footed tortoise, and he is from South America. He gets his name from those red spots you see on his feet. Now, all time, what makes the difference between a turtle and a tortoise? Do, and does anybody know? What do you think? Exactly right. So tortoises are land animals. Yeah. Well, turtles can be smaller than this tortoise, but turtles can also be quite big. So the thing about turtles is that at least part of their life they spend in the water. And when they spend that time in the water, they have bodies that make them better designed for water. They have webbed feet. And they have kind of skinnier shells, if you will, more streamlined. Tortoises spending their time on land, they've developed body parts that help them survive on land better. They've got stumpy feet. They've got that high dome shell. And talking about the shell, does anybody know what a turtle or tortoise's shell is made out of? I'll give you a hint. We have it. It's hard, and it's inside our bodies. Yeah. Bone, excellent. So a turtle or tortoise's shell is made from bone, covered in keratin, and we have keratin as well. You feel your fingernails? That is keratin. But underneath, what makes the shell so hard is bone. And I want everyone to feel your backbone. You know where your backbone is? I want all of you to feel your ribs. Those bones, if you were a turtle or a tortoise, would be connected or fused to your shell. So do you think you'd be able to come out of your shell? No, not at all. Those cartoons have been lying to you, thinking that you could take off the shell and leave a turtle in their underwear. Not true at all. It is their body, not just their home. Now, turtles and tortoises are what we call omnivores. That means they eat what? What do omnivores eat? Yeah. They eat plants, is that the only thing they eat? They, they eat? What? Yeah. I heard it over there, I heard it over there, and they also eat meat. I like to think of it as an omnivore sees food and it goes ob nom nom nom. <laughs> so, he is an omnivore. And we're going to meet two, another omnivore later today as well.